Hasta la vista, baby. I am the Baconator. I'll be back. <laughs> Is that all you remember from the movie? Yeah. <laughs> you got turkey bacon in your jacket there, uh, Arnold? <laughs> yeah, because, like, I'm not the Terminator, I'm the Baconator. I got it. Got it? Got it. I'll be back. This was a lot funnier in our heads before we started filming. Put that cookie down! <laughs> no, that's the wrong movie. <laughs> those pants <laughs> one more get it started guys you thought the low calorie big mac was awesome this video we're doing the baconator from wendy's but low calorie oh yeah i'm the baconator that's not <laughs> no that was my own version <laughs> okay guys Seriously, if you love your food, you're craving fast food, you can do it. Get your craving out low calorie style. So me and Nicole have been dieting for a long time, but we're not ready for a cheat day. No. And we wanted a bacon cheeseburger. We've been having a lot of cravings lately, but we're not ready. We're still wanting to be in a calorie deficit and lose more weight. So we decided to make our own version of the Wendy's Baconator. A copycat. Baconator, but low calorie. And you are not gonna believe the calories that you're gonna save if you make our version. And we'll tell you at the end, it tastes amazing. Okay, amazing. So, this is how we're gonna start. Now this Baconator, let's rate it first of all, so we can okay. be honest with them. Right, I would say, if you're comparing it to the real Baconator from Wendy's, seven to eight out of 10. It's not gonna be, exactly like the wendy's one because we're using ground turkey instead of beef but seven to eight out of ten it tastes so close guys and amazing and it got out our cheeseburger bacon craving and we saved a ton of calories and we used like real low calorie stuff and it filled us up whoa you get massive volume like You'll see ours is huge. Yes. That's, that's what she said. That's what she said. So we also like tried to make it as close to the Baconator as possible. So it's going to taste as close as we could get it using all low calorie stuff. We even looked up a picture of the Baconator on something called the internet. Yes. And we served it with baked fries, which is literally just potatoes with salt and a little bit of cooking spray. And you'll see us trying that with the B-roll we took. You'll see some of the fry action too. And so it was like a Wendy's experience at home, low calorie. So we started, everything is from Walmart. So you can also do this on a budget. This is what we got. These are the great value hamburger buns. 120 calories for the whole bun. I was really surprised. Then we use ground turkey, as lean as you can find. And we also bought some turkey bacon to use instead of obviously the full fat bacon. So this is the butterball kind. And the Baconator has six slices of bacon on it. We, to save calories, we took three slices of turkey bacon and cut them in half to create six slices so you still get the experience, you just get less calories. Because this butterball uh, turkey bacon is huge. Like when you go yeah. to a fast food place, their bacon pieces are very tiny. These are huge, so we figured save some calories, cut them in half. Yeah, because it wouldn't have fit on the bun, it would have looked really silly. Oh, too. you want to tell them the trick that we learned on the fly to make, you know how in food pictures the bacon Bacon's like wavy. Oh, yeah, Kyle was like, I want this bacon, I want our bacon to look like this. How can we do it? And I said, well, what if we tried putting toothpicks in the bacon to kind of like create waves? So he did it and it freaking worked. It worked. It worked. We were so excited that it worked and it actually made it more voluminous and look like we nailed the picture, guys. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, like it looks amazing. And Baconator also has ketchup and mayo on it. So we did the calorie-wise 
Miracle Whip, which is like 20 calories, I think. No, sorry, 30 calories for a tablespoon, which is amazing. And then the no sugar added ketchup, the Heinz kind, is like 10 less calories than regular ketchup. So it's for 10 calories for one tablespoon. We're not sacrificing flavor, but we're saving calories on every step. Yeah, so first we made the burgers. And it's a half a pound of ground beef in the Baconator. So we did the same amount in Four, uh, two four ounce turkey patties. We weighed it raw and we did four ounces, two of them, and we made them square because the Baconator ones are square. So we, you know. Does anybody know it. why Wendy's has square patties? Maybe just to be different? Wendy, we need an answer. Okay, guys, you tell us down below. Why are they square? And. I think because it's hip to be square. Hip to be square? How do you square dance? Like. Do you like actually go in a square? Like, yeah, you did it right did, there. That's is perfect. Is it seriously like? Do you go in a square? Yeah, you're doing it. <laughs> do you like my slippers? Nailed it. Okay, so preheat a pan, a big frying pan on medium high heat. Then you put your square burgers on five minutes. You gotta think. spray the pan first. Spray the pan. Little with cooking, cooking spray. spray. Get it smoking hot, medium heat, because you want that nice crust on the turkey to yeah. make it taste even closer to beef. Yeah, and uh, salt and pepper. We did sea salt and pepper. Generous sea salt, the turkey needs the flavor. And what do we do? We did four minutes, no. We did five minutes per side for the burgers, and then we preheated a smaller pan, sprayed it with cooking spray for the turkey bacon, and like I said, we took three slices, cut them in half to make six small slices, and we put toothpicks in them to make them curly. Yeah, fold it in the middle, and then put a toothpick right through the middle, and you'll get some curvy bacon. And then we did four minutes per side for the bacon. And then we just slightly patted the grease off and with paper towels, and that was it. Then we built the Baconator. So we took the bottom bun, and this is how you build it. And you're gonna see me looking down because I might forget how I built it. Because there's a copied, specific special order. And we copied the picture exactly. So you start with the bottom bun, then you place your burger, then cheese. Then you put three bacon, then you put the next burger, then you top it with cheese, and we're using fat-free cheese slices. And then, on the lid, or the top of the bun, you put a table, well, we did a tablespoon, I don't know what Wendy's uses, but that what we, is what we, we blah, blah, blah. that's we, what we use. Yeah, we estimated about what we would like, and yeah. to keep the calories down. So a tablespoon of the calorie-wise Miracle Whip, and then a tablespoon of the no sugar added ketchup. And then we put that baby on top, this thing was delicious. Amazing. And then with the fries on the side, like it seriously tasted like we were at Wendy's. And again, seven to eight out of 10. And it's not, it doesn't take that long to make. Like. Very quick, very cheap. Uh, we, we prepped it like, I don't know, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. I would say 10, 15 minutes because we cooked the bacon and the burgers at the same time on separate pans. So you're saving yourself time there. So quick. Cheap, because everything's from Walmart. And now, listen to the calories and what you're gonna save eating our seven to eight out of 10 versus the real Baconator. So the real Baconator, 970 calories. Wow. 66 grams of fat, 36 grams of carbs, and 58 grams of protein. For our low calorie version, 606 calories. Whoa. 34 grams of carbs, 27 grams of fat, and 64 grams of protein. You are saving, get this, you're saving 364 calories doing it our low calorie. For burger. one burger. For one burger. And ours is huge, it's not like we made a tiny burger. No, you get a lot of food. 28 grams of fat, you are saving 28 grams of fat. Repeat that, 28 grams so of fat. So fat, I did it. <laughs> he likes being sassy. Um, and you are adding six grams of protein. Whoa. So you're lowering your calories, lowering the fat, and adding protein. What? I wanted to throw stuff when I did that. <laughs> That's ridiculous. 
and, and it's, it's ridiculously good. It's almost as good as the other one. We're not gonna lie, it's a lower calorie version, it's not gonna be identical. But if you want a low calorie version so that you can get your cravings out, not go off track off of your diet so you can still lose weight, this is for you. Your kids will love this, your idiot oh. partner will love this. <laughs> You can serve this, you could serve these at a party to your family, they would not know. You can also, like Nicole, walk in as the Baconator. Exactly, and all you have to do for that is get a fake leather jacket and carry turkey bacon. You first zip up the jacket and then put the turkey bacon inside. You need sunglasses too. Oh yeah, you need, and um, since mine are scratched, you wear sassy sunglasses, and that's it. Then and just remember, all of our jokes will not work in public or around normal human beings. They won't laugh. They'll just probably call the police or something. But you guys laughed, didn't you? Okay, and if you don't know, Kyle and I have lost 130 pounds each and kept it off for six years because we love our food. We make low calorie versions of our favorite things most of the time and then give ourselves the real thing every once in a while. But because we make stuff like this, we don't need the real thing very often because we love what we eat. And my pants are getting bigger and I'm eating low calorie baconators. So how do you go, how do you, how do you guys not go off track? We don't have a track. We eat low calorie baconators. We eat the <laughs> All right. So if you want to know exactly what we did to lose our first and next 50 pounds, we have two weight loss guides down below, exact meals, exact portions, exact family friendly recipes, everything is in there, exactly what we ate, we didn't take anything away and we ate tasty stuff. And watch these two videos, like, share, subscribe, share this wealth. You can have everyone love their food if you share this video, like it, subscribe, hit the bell, do the stuff so we can love the world and share. Make it a better place, they can eat low calorie bacon eaters. This is the world. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna do my spatula flip. We're gonna do this, Whoa. Oh, whoops, and we're gonna spank that beam. No, you can't do that on YouTube, you know, whoa. If you color the beam, you can. Because they don't know what beam is. Um, the algorithm it doesn't. So it can be. <laughs> <laughs> See you guys. Bye guys. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.